Let's head west now, where Nigeria's long wait for a medal at the ongoing Olympic Games ended after the West African nation picked up two medals in athletics and wrestling. A bronze medal in athletics is Nigeria's first at the Olympic Games in 13 years, but sports enthusiasts are not satisfied with the outing. Here is CGTN's Kelechi Emekalam with the details. The Tokyo 2020 marks Nigeria's 17th appearance at the Olympic Games. The nation featured in about 10 sports, including athletics, combat and team sports. Expectations were high as the Nigerian contingent went into the Games. But as the competition nears its end, sports enthusiasts are left disappointed with the subpar performances recorded so far. It's not been a very cheering one. It's been very disturbing. We've had more embarrassing moments than would have loved to have more medal moments that Nigerians will celebrate and our national anthem will be sung in Tokyo, but we'd rather have had more embarrassing and shameful moments in Tokyo. I didn't see us as a nation really prepared for this year because the flaws were just so much. They had so much my athletics. Um, going back to the national trials this year, there were a lot of new records that came back home for us. Since making its Olympic debut in 1952, Nigeria only boasts of three gold medals. Well, so far, the West African nation has two medals from Tokyo 2020, a bronze and a silver from the women's long jump and wrestling, respectively. From athletes violating the World Athletics anti-doping rules to failing doping tests in the middle of the competition, sports experts are saying these series of man-made blunders could have been avoided. That is also an administrative failure on those who manage our sports whether the Nigeria Olympic Committee, the Nigerian Sports Ministry, the Federation, Athletic Federation of Nigeria, that runs uh, uh, these sports is a failure on their side because it's an administrative thing. It's not about the athletes now. When you are preparing for a major champion, you should follow up on your athletes and know exactly what they are doing. Have they done what they are supposed to do? These rules by WADA, they are out there on their website, so it should be at your fingertips. Athletes, on their own, they try to prove themselves to show people that this is what we can do if we have resources. All blame on the ministry because they did not do well for the athletes. Throughout this year, we just have three competitions only for an athlete preparing for the Olympics. The progress of Nigerian sports has been hampered by a barrage of technical issues. Funding is a recurring decimal. Poor preparation is a recurring decimal. Fire brigade approach is a recurring decimal. Athletes' welfare is a recurring decimal. And then, of course, not to forget the issue of uh, facilities, sporting facilities or sporting infrastructure. We also need to work on that and then sports science. Despite a vibrant youth population, grassroots sports have remained underdeveloped. Sports enthusiasts say it's about time Nigeria concentrates on building on its grassroots sports, developing infrastructure, and focusing on advancing sports where the nation has a competitive edge. Kilechi Emekalam, CGT and Abuja, Nigeria.